Oscar night is supposed to be magical in Hollywood, of course, but this year, the sex scandal flooding the industry could put a damper on things. CBS 2's Lisa Siegel is live in Hollywood as they prepare for Sunday. Lisa. Yes, Pat, there is a lot going on this year and a lot of things that will be talked about, but you can't get away from this beautiful Oscar feeling that there is. You can see the setup behind me. This is the red carpet. Everyone is just getting busy. And yes, right down here, the beautiful red carpet the celebrities will be on, but right now it's covered in a tarp because of the rain. I just want to show you what it's like here. Media from all across the word world, well, they line the outer lines right here and this is where the celebrities will talk and if you look over here this is where the bleachers are that some very lucky fans will sit at and if you're wondering if the rain is going to affect Oscar well it already has there he is in his trench coat nothing stops Oscar not even the rain as crews work round the clock to get ready for Hollywood's biggest night media from around the globe are here and ready to go Christina Yang is from the Chinese Movie Channel. I think this is a super big event all across the world, and uh, why not in China? But this is no ordinary year. Rebecca's son is a senior reporter with The Hollywood Reporter. This is the 90th anniversary of the Oscars, and so I think the producers really do, with all of the things that are going on, obviously, in our industry and in the real world, they do want to have it be a celebration of, you know, nine decades of, you know, celebrating film. Still, she says there are some things that can't be ignored. Ryan Seacrest, a staple covering E's red carpet, is in a scandal of his own, accused by his former stylist Susie Hardy of abuse and harassment. Seacrest denies the claims completely, but stars like Jennifer Lawrence are already trying to decide how she'll approach him. She told this to Howard Stern. He has not been to trial for anything. He's not, right. I am not a judge. I am not a jury. You know, I, 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 I don't know. I mean, that, that, that's where this stuff gets gets tricky. It, it's definitely going to be closely watched. Absolutely, people are going to be seeing who's talking to Ryan, who's not talking to Ryan. And then Sun says the Academy is not overlooking these changing times. She tells us the Me Too and Time's Up movement will not be ignored. So the Time's Up organizers have said that they've worked with the Oscar producers to create a moment during the telecast to acknowledge, you know, what's going on and what they've been doing. And I also asked if there was any particular color that people were being asked to wear or a pin. And I'm told that is really on an individual basis, whatever the celebrity or the person who is coming here decides to wear. But I want to show you back here again. You can see it live from the red carpet. Everybody getting ready for Oscar's 90th birthday. Back to you.